We, Akatsuki, will deliver judgment. Hello everyone, and welcome to the Blue Mage Brilli Pokemon Nuzlocke. Now for this Nuzlocke, we have very special rules, or that is to say, very common rules. Since this is the first Blue Mage Brilli Pokemon Nuzlocke, we've decided to go with very basic rules that will be explained right now. Rule number one. Any Pokemon that faints in battle is considered to be dead. They will be released or stored into a box. This will be voted on in chat for about three minutes. I will be arguing my case on what I feel is best for the Pokemon in question. Will you choose Mercy? Or, well, something far more sinister? Rule number two. The starting Pokemon will be based on the trainer ID card. 1 to 3 is Grass, 4 to 6 is Fire, 7 to 9 is Water, and 0 is Blue Mage Brilli's Pick. Also, any Pokemon we capture must be nicknamed. Rule number 3. You can only capture the first Pokemon encountered in each area and none else. We will also be using the Species Clause, so it isn't just the same Pokemon over and over and over again. What this means is if I already own the Pokemon, it does not count towards the one per route aspect. Even event Pokemon are also allowed, but training for them with NPCs is not allowed since we cannot name those. 
Rule number four, the Nuzlocke does not officially start until the Pokeballs are received. This includes death, but does not include the nickname clause. The starter does have to be nicknamed. And then we have rule number five, for extra difficulty, the game will be set to, well, set. Which means that Blue Mage Brilli will have to manually switch to Pokemon, rather than having the chance to do so when the po opponent switches Pokemon in battle. And that is all the rules we have for this Nuzlocke. So without further ado, let's get started with Pokemon Emerald Nuzlocke. I did say Emerald, didn't I? My bad. <laughs> Platinum is what I meant to say, but I was reading something that said Emerald. All that work and I failed at the end, but that's okay. Yeah, yeah, I messed up. It's because I'm reading something while I was talking. My bad. Regardless, welcome to Pokemon Platinum Nuzlocke. And I did a lot of little setup here. Now the plan for the part under me was going to be either a graveyard or where all their Pokemon go, but I couldn't get it set up. I couldn't figure out how to connect it to the emulator for this. Thank you for the good luck, and also, as per always, hello OP, hello Sivia, hello Loex, hello Reborn, and hello Lori, and hello Dragon K4. Hope you are all having a good day. Whoops. It did not appreciate me clicking on it, apparently. And yes, Sivia is licking Giratina. The darkness. Thank you for the bits. I appreciate it. Oh, I put those wrong on my notes, whoops. Hello there! It's so very nice to meet you. It was pretty okay. Went out and got myself a sandwich. Good luck for and some chicken. At six. Thank Eight. you for the good luck, too. Jeez, all these bits already. Thank you very much. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. Now, I didn't actually test this at all with this Pokemon thing, so I have no idea if this is going to actually super work, but hopefully it won't have any glitches. Everyone just calls me the Pokemon Professor. Before I go any further, is this your first adventure? If you need advice, I'm certainly capable of giving it. Nope, I'm good. Apparently that's not the A button. Here, I have Pokeball. Touch the button and screen in the middle of the Pokeball if you please. No, no, not that button. The button on the Pokeball. I don't know if he understands that. This is not how this works. Now look at the little bunny. We humans live so alongside Pokemon. At times we play together, and at times we work together. <laughs> other times we're, you know, busy killing each other, but that's not important. What do I do? I conduct research so we may learn more about the Pokemon. Young ten-year-old with a... Semi beard and a lot of issues. Why don't you tell me about yourself? All right. Hmm. Actually, I can do this now that I have this set up with the pole. Uh, let's see here. Oh. Since this is the first one, let's see here. I will put this at... Let's give it two minutes. And then... Start. <sighs> so put in your options. One, let's see. Zero for boy, one for girl. You have two minutes. 
Shiny hunting a Turtwig? I think the Turtwig one does look pretty good. I wish you luck. I think you just... Yeah, there you go. Lori's got it. You gotta do vote one in order to vote for the girl. Really? That sounds weird. Wow. Reborn flipping for that. No problem. The scarf? Or is it the ascot? Is that what that is? I don't know. I only really remember Fred from Scooby Doo doing that. Alright, how long does this have? It has 30 seconds remaining. 35 seconds. One equal one? Alright, I can accept. And agree with that. Also, there is a high chance that this will actually be putting be put on YouTube. You know. For the record. Even my mistake. Embarrassing as it is. I don't know why I said it. Curse you text boxes. Five seconds. I think everyone's voted, but... Might as well let it go through. Let the bot do its thing. And the winner with three votes is Boy. So are we a boy or are we a girl? Turns out we're actually a boy. Alright, so you're a boy. Are you sure about that? But I do like wearing scarves that I've never worn before. Tell me, what is your name? Ah, uh, that is actually a good question. I didn't actually think of a good name. I mean, I could just go basic. Oh, really? Brisser. Yeah, that's my name. Uh, let's see here. Honestly, what I usually do is go brilly, so... I can't have some weird amalgamation name because I'm doing this alone. Oh, I think for the first one, since this is the first Nuzlocke I've ever done... How long am I going to stream? Probably about two to three. Hours. Really? And because we did do it, it we're a boy. Like, 100%. That's a boy. Right? We should do that, right? <laughs> Not days. Then I would explode. Don't say years. Don't say years. <laughs> yeah, two to three minutes. It's already been 13. I'm a dirty liar. Let's go with really. Your name is Brilly. Yes. No. But yes. Okay, so you're Brilly. A fine name, that is. Now this boy here, I believe he's your friend. I don't have any friends. I said don't say years, and you did it anyways. What might his name be? Barry, Nolan, Roy, Gavin. He's not my boy, so he can't be Roy. There we go. There is our friend Sivio, who constantly sasses me, apparently. Cravatter. Wow. How rude. Now I gotta do this. Sivio P. Nah, I'm not gonna do that. Oh no! I pressed OK! <laughs> I was trying to press back. No. Is that your friend's name? No, it's not. What was his name? I don't know. No. Exactly. You should have never said anything. Now you're this guy, who I don't even remember what he does. That's your friend's name? Yes. Alright, really? Time has come. I mean, 
Your very own tale of grand adventure is about to unfold. On your journey, you will meet countless Pokemon and people. Don't, don't look at the future, hacker. I'm sure along that way, along the way, you will discover many things. Perhaps even something about yourself. It's deep. Now, go on, leap into the world of Pokemon. And then he shrinks me with his shrink ray. At least I have a cool hat. At least I have a cool hat. Pokemon are by your side. I hope always. I hope you'll understand the meaning of those words. That comment was left by Professor Ronan, who has returned to Sinnoh from the Kanto region. Be named after the first dead Pokemon. This concludes our special program. Let's ask Professor Rowan. Brought to you by Shrink Rays. How do they work? Why was everyone huge to begin with? Also brought to you by Jubilee Life TV on National Wide Net. See you next week. Same time, same channel, same shrinkage. Whoa. Sivial rushing into my room. There you are. I can't do Sivia voice. That's way too gentle for me. Hey, really? You see that TV? Sure you did. Professor Rowan's that really important guy who studies Pokemon, right? That means he must have lots and lots of Pokemon. So if we ask him, they give us a Pokemon. Oh, hey, I'm gonna go on your internets. This is a new PC. <laughs> uh, where was I? Oh, right. We're gonna go see Professor Rowan and get some po Pokemon, right? I've been waiting outside. Okay, Billy, if you're late, I'm gonna find you $10 million. <laughs> The X button opens the menu. But you didn't know that. Okay. Oh, he's been Mem with her blue hair. Oh yeah, Dawn had a blue-haired mom, didn't she? Really? Zibio already left. I don't know what it was about, but sure was in a hurry. That's all I had to tell you. It's not like he was up your room or anything. Anyways, I'm gonna go back to watching TV. Oh yeah, really. Don't go into the dark grass. Also, I could use an egg beater. What Pokemon might attack you? Anyways, be okay if you're on your Pokemon, but you don't, so... Well, take care, sweetie. I'm in Twin Leaf Town. Look at those pixels. Look at those beautiful pixels. Everyone loves pixels. <laughs> Fresh and free. Can I not move faster than this? I don't have my running boots! Why can't I run without my shoes? Whoa, what? Hey, whoa, 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 hey, Ip, really? I was looking for you, or Sivia was looking for you, I don't care about you. I think he's at home now, why don't you go check him out? <laughs> I was getting, uh... What's his name? The guy from Family Guy, that's what I was going for with that. Thud. Probably didn't remember what that voice was. What was that about? Oh, hey, really? Hey, I'm gonna go see Professor Rowan. You should come, too, and quickly. Oh, jeez, I forgot something. Alright, well, I'm gonna go with, talk to Professor Ronan. How do I talk to Professor Ronan? Where is Professor Ronan? There's only four houses. I don't know. Key item in the bag could be assigned to this button for instant use. Don't tell me that. I was pressing B. Hello, Sivio's mom. Ah, I better take my bag and my journal, too. Oh. Oh, hey, Billy. I've been waiting on the road. It's ten million fine if you're late. I owe Sivia twenty million dollars. In an alternate universe. Hi, Sivio's mom. See you later. Because I go talk to her, but it sounds way too much like Sivio. Eh, so slow. I want to run already. Too slow. All right, let's get moving to Professor Ruin's lab. I'm gonna die. This is where we're gonna die. Sivio's gonna kill me. What? Don't go into grass, right? No worries, no problem. Doesn't matter that we don't have any Pokemon. Trust me on this one. I got boots for days. I got an idea. Now you listen. You know how wild Pokemon jump out and go in tall grass? Well, the trick is, just cut the grass. All you do is scoot over next to a patch of grass before any pod Pokemon could appear. You just keep dashing, we can get to San Jim Town without it running into any wild Pokemon. Alright, stick with me. Alright, here it goes. On your marks. Held it. Ow. 
Oh look, Professor Ronan was over here the entire time. You don't, you two don't seem to have any Pokemon between you. Then what is the meaning of going into tall grass? Uh... Hey, really? This old guy? It's Professor Ronan, is it? What's he doing here? They tried to go into tall grass because they wanted Pokemon. Hmm, what to do? Their world would surely change if they were to meet Pokemon. It's almost like they lived with Pokemon for... 23... Uh, 10 years. Is it right for me to put them on that path? I am a professor. You two, you two truly love Pokemon, do, do you not? Uh, I mean, I guess. Well, hold up. You're not making any sense, Pierre. Ahem. <laughs> I didn't quite catch that, so I will ask you again. You two, you truly love Pokemon. Oh, did I say no accidentally? Whoops. Yeah, me too. I love Pokemon too. I will ask you once again. You two. What? What? You can ask a hundred times. Answer will always will never change. We'll both answer a hundred times. We love Pokemon. Right, really? Yeah, sure. A pair of reckless kids who foolishly try to enter tall grass without Pokemon of their own? Worries me that people like that would do that with Pokemon. It's almost like we have an entire system set up where Pokemon fight each other and kill each other for fun. Eh, uh, well, I... Well, and forget about me, but give a Pokemon to my friend, really. I mean, here. I mean, his name is Billy, but he's here. Uh, I mean, it was me who tried to get tall grass and all. <gasps> How big of you? Very well, then. I won't trust you two with Pokemon. I did not check my thing, did I? Hmm. Hopefully I get another chance, because I did not actually check my thing, did I? Whoops. Professor Rowan, you left your briefcase at the lake. Oh, something wrong here? Oh, there it is. What was it doing? What was it about to entrust these two with their own Pokemon? Pardon? Those two are hard to replace. Those Pokemon are hard to replace. You sure you're about giving them away? Hmm. Maybe they're side by side with Pokemon. There comes a time when people should meet Pokemon. It's almost like that we live beside them. There's a world that should be explored together. To them, today is the time. This place right here. Go on, open that briefcase and choose a Pokemon. Really? Thanks, Fresh Rune. Can't believe it. I'm so happy now. Can't keep a straight face. Hey, really? You can choose first. I'm practically grown up, so I have to show some class here. Wow, Sivia with the grown upness. Okay, where's the start? There we go. Okay, so, moment of truth here. Our player ID is 4, and if I remember the rules correctly, I believe that is fire. I will double check just to make sure. Ah, uh, nope, that's not it. Why should I have, like, four of these? Yep, that is four to six is fire. So that means we get... I don't remember. Uh, what's up with you? Open the briefcase and pick a po- I'm trying to walk around, okay? I don't want to, like, walk to the side of the briefcase to open up. Do you know how uncomfortable that is? I have to, like, lean over to the side, to the other side of the briefcase, to reach the other latch, okay? Give me a break. Anyways. <laughs> Look, these are Pokeballs. There's a Pokemon in each one. Now choose, which Pokemon will it be? No. We are getting the Chimp Pokemon, Chimchar. And I choose you. I'm picking this Pimpla. That's the one I wanted, though. <laughs> Very well. Both of you have chosen a good Pokemon, it seems. Now listen well. The Pokemon you have been entrusted with are unfamiliar with the world. It's almost like they've lived in a briefcase this entire time. In that regard, they're very much like you. As fellow newcomers to the world, I hope you'll do well together. If you have any trouble, come see me at my lab in Sanjim Town, which is in the way or past this grass or whatever. Now we'll be on our way. Professor, wait for me, please. I'm sorry, please let me pass. You're totally in my way. Like, totally. Well, how do you like that? Professor Rowan's really nice. On TV, he's so stern and scary. <laughs> hey, really? We both got Pokemon now. So only one thing to do, right? Are you up for this? Yes. I've always wanted to say this. Time's finally come. Really, I challenge you to a battle. I do like the battle music. 
Alright, stop dancing. Because I don't have other voices! If I did a high-pitched voice, it'd be way too embarrassing. Also, they're like, totally radical voices, Sibia. Just growl. How rude. What in the- That one hurt you! I don't know your name! You didn't nickname your Pokémon yet! Really? Stop growling at me, you darn penguin. Like, why not? <laughs> I'm gonna leer at you, darn penguin. <laughs> what other voice is there that's, like, totally radical? Two can play at this game, darn penguin. Why are you only growling at me? Can penguins even growl? <sighs> I don't even like California rolls. I have once or twice. None of them are like totally radical though. Hello Serum, how's it going? We're gonna scratch this penguin because he only wants to growl at us. Ow! Finally! Punch me in the face, please. I can't do any damage, but we're gonna rely on that crit. That crit damage will carry us through. I'm only doing one damage, aren't I? Is whatever I say. I will win this first battle. The crit damage did not carry us through. It was only determination. Chimchar gained 70 experience points. Ding! It's okay if I wipe out here, because it's the beginning. We haven't actually started yet, technically. What? What are you saying? We end up losing? Ugh, fine. I guess I'll give you $500, I guess. Yeah. Let's go home. I'm beat after that battle. It's almost like my penguin got beat up. My Pokemon needs rest too. See it, really? He teleports away. Oh, he teleported me! What's the matter, dear? Well, that's what happened to you, huh? You and Sylvia were lucky to have met Professor Rowan. You would have got eaten by the Pokemon. Man, if you didn't. Wouldn't like to think what would, uh... What Pokemon might have done to you? Go see Professor Rowan and think properly for your Pokemon. That was Zandrum Town, didn't it? Now you have your own Pokemon, Telegrass won't be so threatening. Now we can finally escape this prison. Oh, I know. Put these on. Gather your team and avenge the fallen. I'll do my best, but... Going to Zandrum Town is like an adventure in itself, right? With those running shoes, you can go to faraway places much faster. Alright, let me read the instructions for you. Because you obviously cannot read. Press B to dash. And that's it. Put on the racing shoes to blaze their new trails of adventure. Isn't that just nifty? Alright, see you later. And we never talked again. My Pokemon healed. Why couldn't I name the Pokemon, though? Hmm, I'm assuming that happens later. Because I don't remember what can... What happens for this one. Alright, see ya, Dragon K4. Thanks for stopping by. Uh-oh. Too slow, Brittany. I'm sick of waiting. I didn't even tell you I was waiting out here, but I'm sick of waiting. I'm gonna see Professor Rowan, so I can think it properly. So I have this great idea. Listen up, okay? You know the lake we always play at? You know how the legendary Pokemon lives there, I guess? You guessed it. Let's go catch that Pokemon. You know, it's totally not fake or anything. That'll make Professor Rowan happy. Me and you together, we got nothing to fear. Uh... Assuming the lake is this way, since it's... Yeah, okay. Since... Alright, we're at the lake. That was really, really far away. Get ready, because we're capturing that legendary Pokemon. Wait a second. We don't even have Pokeballs. But trust me on this one. It even says here in this sign. Okay, good to know that it comes later. What's going on? The flowing time. The expanding space. I will make it mine one day. 
Cyrus is my name. Remember it, space. I will conquer it. Until then, sleep while you can, legendary Pokemon of the lake bed. Allow me to pass. Step aside. So polite. What was that about? Weird guy. Okay, really. Let's catch that legendary Pokemon. Kayun. Hey, what was that? Wow, did you hear that, really? That's the next Pokemon cry. It had to be. It could be anything else we've heard. Alright, is that a chance? Let's catch it. Even though we can't see it. Wait a second, what? We don't have anything on us. You know, Pokeballs. P -p accent buzz. That's pretty good. I don't remember that. P O K accent E balls. If you don't have those, can't catch any Pokemon or take them around with us. You think Professor Rowan would give us some if you asked him? You know, you remember what he said, don't you? Says we didn't lab, we need anything. You know, I, I, th I think that counts as anything. Alright, Billy, I'll race you. First one, Professor Rowan's lab, and Sandy Time Rules. Here we go. I can run now. Look how fast I am. Moving at three pixels a second. Better not get pulled over by the Poke Police. Also, these people are just trapped here. Like, if they didn't have Pokemon, they'd be just trapped here. Do you have Pokemon? If your Pokemon health, that's its HP. It's getting low. You should go home and get some rest. Okay. <gasps> what are we gonna encounter? A cricket. A cri crick top? Because this does not count towards the Nuzlocke, we do not have Pokeballs yet. Chimchar, you scratch. Scratch that darn cricket. I never really got into using this Pokemon. I don't think I've ever used this Pokemon. I caught it once. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Can I kill it in time? The answer may surprise you as a no. I'm totally gonna die. I'm gonna die as Cricket. <sighs> Didn't die. But guess where we're going? <laughs> we're going back home. Hey, Mom, you know how you said we never... I said we would never talk again? Yeah. Well, I went outside and a Cricket beat me up. Yeah, you heard right, a Cricket. It just shook its legs at me and my ears exploded. Also, Chimchar got beat up by a Pokemon. But that's not important. Important thing is, my eye needs to be shut for a bit. I wonder if I talk to her. To... I do. Darn it. Oh, hey, Mom, how's it going? Hey, welcome home, really? You and your Pokemon healthy? That's main dinner. Take a quick rest, dear. Alright, see you later, Mom. Well, thanks, Sivio. Get out of my way, thank you. That was mean of me. I should have been more polite. Hey, bird! I did have one of these. Can I just run away from this? So I can get Pokemon? Nah. I'm being polite to you as well. <laughs> what else did I got beat up by a cricket? Like a Pokemon? No, just normal cricket. <laughs> Chimchar got beat up by a Pokemon. But, uh, you know, he'll be okay. Six health, that's nothing. I mean, it's something, but it's more than nothing. Unlike my face, which has been covered in cricket wounds. When do I learn Ember? That would be really nice. Oh. I should say less things. They tend to happen. Oh, there you are. Please come with me. Presser is waiting. This is it, our Pokemon Research Lab. Let's go. Thud. Why are you always gonna run into me? What the? Oh, it's you, Brilly. That old guy. He's not scary so much as he is totally out there. Oh, it doesn't matter, Brilly. I'm out of here. See you later. 
Wow, what was that? French sure seems to be really impatient. Well, anyways, let's go inside. When do I get Pokeballs? <laughs> well, well, look who's here. Really, was it? Uh, let's see, let's have a look at your Pokemon. Hmm, I see. Pokemon seems to be rather happy. It's been like two seconds. Trusting you with that Chimchar was no mistake, it seems. I'd like to give it a nickname? Yes. What is our Chimchar's nickname gonna be? I will take suggestions from the chat, because I got no ideas. Usually what I do is just do this. And like... Well, obviously I know what name goes with that one. With all those letters I got, it's obviously the best Pokemon name that could possibly exist. <laughs> That's what those letters made me think about. When I just put in random letters, I got Nickelback. If you guys have any other suggestions, <laughs> throw them out there. Otherwise, we may have Nickelback the Chimchar. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't know if he'll uh, be a one-hit wonder or not. <laughs> Got Rafiki from Lion King. I don't know if he's quite that monkey, but... Well, that's another for Nickelback. He's got musical things. Alright, well, it looks like Nickelback is our new Chimchar. <laughs> My only thing is, if we get a dog, I know what his name's gonna be. Are you happy with that nickname? No, but yeah. When I first saw you two about to step into tall grass, even though, oh, without Pokemon, I was shocked. I was astounded by these foolhardy children. But now you've astounded me in an entirely different way, by walking through the tall grass with Pokemon. Already there's a bond growing between you and that Nickelback. I feel privileged to have met you. I'm sure Chimchar feels the same way about you. If only I could have met you earlier, like by walking five minutes down the road. Well, I'll ask you to cherish that Chimchar of yours. I'm like so glad that you're like totally kind towards Pokemon. And I don't know where this accent came from, but like if you weren't, I'd have to, oh, I just can't say it. I'd probably have to beat you up. Uh, uh, hmm. Let's move on to the main topic. There's something I want you to do for me. Allow me to properly introduce myself first. My name, as you know, is Rowan. I study Pokemon. First of all, I want to know exactly what kinds of Pokemon live in the Sinnoh region. To do so is necessary to collect data using the Pokedex. That's what I wish to ask you. I want to trust you with this Pokedex. Will you record all data of all Pokemon in Sinnoh for me? Yeah, sure. Hmm. Good answer. I'm glad all my voices have characters attached to them. That Pokedex is very high-tech device. Just like my hemorrhoids. It will automatically record data on every kind of Pokemon you encounter. Just like my hemorrhoid. Really, I like that you... I ask that you go and meet... Uh, go everywhere and meet every kind of Pokemon in this region. I got one too. When you walked up to Route 201 with your Pokemon, what did you feel? I've lived for 60 long years. Even now I get a thrill when I'm with Pokemon. Now you should know there are countless Pokemon in this world. That's what it means. That means there are just as many thrills waiting for you out there. Hello, Tsunami Poro. How's it going? Now go! Really, your grand adventure begins right now. Right this second. The Pokemon that I met for the first time was a Turtwig, and it totally was not the one in the briefcase. If you would have chosen the Turtwig on Route 21, we have the same Pokemon now. Not that it matters, but... Wait, does that always happen? Or does she always get the third one? That's pretty interesting if it's always Turtwig. I also helped the professor add pages to the Pokedex, so in a sense, I'm just like you. Except, you know, I got a cool scarf thing that... Someone feels really mad about? Well, I just got a little head start on you, that's all. Be happy to teach you things. Glad to meet you, Brilly. Did you get the third one? Okay. Wait, I forgot to ask him about Pokeballs. Brilly! I have something to good to hear. You should take this as well. Obtain the TM27. What, the TM27? That is a tactical machine, one that contains the move Return. Wow, they don't usually give that this early. Use the move instantly to Pokemon. Bear in mind, however, this team is single-use only. 
Move your turn gives you more power, the more friendly your Pokemon is towards you. It's up to you, of course, if you want to use that TM or not. I'll send you out to wish your journey will be fun. Oh wow, I didn't know the professor had TMs. Was he a trainer when he was young? You think I would know that? Being like his granddaughter or whatever? I need your mentor. Got a bit more experience in training the professor's assistant. All right, let's go. The ever known tour guide. This building with the red roof is the Pokemon Center. Because it heals a Pokemon that has been hurt in battle. You can find Pokemon Center in most towns. No, okay, OP. In the building with the blue roof over here is the better one, and it's a Pokemon. It's a shop where you can buy and sell items and medicine. Since you're a novice trainer, you won't be able to buy many kinds of merchandise. Don't let it bar you, though. Oh, that's right. Really? Don't you need to let your know? No, I don't, I, don't, I don't need to let them know anywhere. You may, you may need to go far away, so I think you should let someone know. Oh, before you go, heal up Pokemon at the Pokemon Center. It'll be lost, a lot less scary that way. Okay, bye. Was it not red? Uh, I guess it's kind of orange, actually. Anyways, I'm going to talk to him again, see if he gives me free Pokeballs, so the Nuzlocke can truly begin. Come to show me your progress, you made a Pokedex now. But four Pokemon in Sinnoh. Do I... Did he already give me them? No, he did not. That is true. It is night time. Maybe she gives them to me. <sighs> really? Did you tell your family that you're helping the professor? You didn't, did you? I know you're really eager to see all kinds of Pokemon. You shouldn't make your mom worry that you disappeared. I am pretty sure she already knows, but whatever. I'm glad to know we have a guard dog up there. Is he hurt? Nickelback is hurt. Ooh, that lag. Let me go to the Pokemon Center. We restore your tired Pokemon to full health. Would you like to rest your Pokemon? Okay. Your one Pokemon? Thank you. What do you have to say? Talk to that nice lady at the counter and you hand her your Pokemon. She totally won't steal them and replace them with others, I swear. So, I don't forget what happened, so now I better save this. There, now I can take a break. Basically telling me, like, hey, you need to save. What is this house? It sounds like a sign. Wow, she didn't show me her house. Show me the Pokemon Center and the Pokemart. Hey, you don't know, that girl could be middle-aged. Look, it's the only voice I have, unless you want me to get super high-pitched, but that's embarrassing. Wow, I have $3,000. Neat. And now the Nuzlocke truly begins. And, you know, just because I'm a big scary face... Take some potions. Oh yeah, I forgot to do something else. Doesn't really matter because I don't have any uh, Pokemon yet, but... First, take speed fast, please. And... set. Whoops. Maybe they're twins. Maybe Blue Mage Prilly is not actually a voice actor and has no talent in doing so. <laughs> Alright. Oh yeah, I need to open up a thing real quick. One second. Uh, I guess I can just rename this one. Who cares? It's empty anyways. Uh, Pokemon Realty. This. Alright, so what I am doing right here is I'm going to write down every single route we catch something on, and what we catch on it. That way I can't, you know, cheat. And the rule for the routing is if this thing... If a new name pops up, then that's the new route. Exactly, so I don't forget, so I don't cheat. Alright, what's our first Pokemon gonna be? Is it gonna be a hit single? Elvis Cricket? It's a Badoop. I should have expected this. Can I actually hit this Badoop without killing him? 
I'm gonna just throw a Pokeball real quick. Dang it! Ow. Well, he only hits me for one. That's good. We gotta capture this Bidoof. Uh, it appeared to be caught, but then he tackled my face in, so that's cool. There's one Pokeball. I'm trying my best here. Got him. Don't forget to catch something at the lakefront. That is true, but I can also come back and catch something in the water later. Right? I don't know if water is considered different. I didn't actually look up on that rule. The plump mouse Pokemon. A comparison revealed that Bidoof's front teeth grow at the same rate as the Rattata's. Why is that the info they give me? Whatever. Give a nickname to the Bidoof? Yes. Alright, so what's our Bidoof's nickname? And also, welcome back, OP. Water is different? Alright. I'm not getting any good ideas from these random letters. I think I pressed the button too many times there. Let's see, what should we name a Bidoof, though? Hmm. Like, I've never actually... Fox, that's a good one. Darn it. I've been trying to keep up with, like, the... Let's go with, like, band things, but... Bad part is, I don't listen to bands. I listen to songs. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, let's go with... Hmm. Nope. Ah, Pox. Pox Fox. Iron... Irene Maiden? <laughs> Beaver is the name of a rock band. Interesting. But... I saw his face. Now I'm a... I, now I'm a Beaver. Couldn't come up with a pun. Be... Nah, that's dumb. If it was a girl, that would have made more sense. Alright, I'll go with Beaver. I don't care. I don't know how long Bidoof is gonna last, so... Beaver. Well, there's our number two. Who may or may not die. He is full health, though. Alright, Bidoof, buddy. I mean Beaver Buddy. Let's go over here. It's kind of awkward to have someone named Beaver. I'm not going to explain why. I'm going to say it's awkward and leave it at that. Alright, so I'm going to switch you in front real quick. Not for any specific region. Region? Reason. Lake Variety. And we got a Bidoof. Go, Beaver! Show him what's up! Wow, Bidoof used Tackle! Wow, Beaver used Tackle! Not actually a wild beaver, just so you guys know. Alright, well, Nickelback, come on. Come on in. We can always get a Cricket. I'm sure they're around here. Oh, I should use Ember. Is Bidoof a water type yet? I think the upgrade, the upgrade, the ev evolution is a water type. Okay, good. Beaver gained 12 experience points. Ooh, the strategy, I like it. 
I've not looked into this at all, so... So I don't actually know what's going to happen. It's been a couple of years since I've actually played Platinum. Have played Platinum, for sure, but... Rip the Mighty Thor. Don't worry, I'll make sure that scar is not sore. Alright, burn this beaver. Not my beaver, but the other beaver. You know, the unnamed beaver. That is also a beaver. Y'all burn. Wow, but you fainted. Yay, level 3. When do I get flame punch? I think it's fire punch, but... Flame punch sounds better. I played the platinum Pokedex twice, wow. Like everything, everything, or just everything you can get in the game? Either way, that's impressive. Ow. I should have came here first then, huh? So I could have gotten the Padu Fear. Right, I can probably take one more. And then I'll have to go and do something else. I thought about putting a limit on this, by the way, with the Species Clause, but I know my luck. Hey, look, there's a Starling. And I knew that it would take forever. Tackle attack. That Starly attacked me. I can probably do one more. I do remember Star Raptor being pretty good. Also a cool name. Anything Raptor is kind of a cool name, so. Alright, let's go Pokeball. Mac Punch? I did not know that. I always went with Piplup, and I think once I went to Turtwig. Because, you know, I played two of them. But I never went with Chimchar, because I was like, that's, that's a monkey. Gross. Starly's data was added to the Pokedex. Because they are weak individually, they form groups. However, they bicker if the group grows too big. Badoof Raptor? Cool name! Alright, so what's the name of our Starly? CEO. I'm liking that already. CEO Raptor Incorporated. That's what I'm going with. Oh, oh. Hello, Phoenix. How's it going? Rap. Rap dash Incorporated. There we go. CEO of Rap Incorporated. Gonna go stick with that musical theme, I guess. Whoop. Then, you know, I couldn't put in the entire thing, but go talk to mom. Hey mom, I'm going on an adventure. Oh, welcome home, really. Are you and your Pokemon healthy? I just made dinner for the second time today. Take a quick rest. Double dinner? What could it mean? Hmm, what is it really? Well, wow, Professor Rowan asked you to do something that big. Alright, go for it. Your mom's got your back. I'm gonna go make dinner. I got something you'll find useful. I got a journal. That's a journal. Keeps a record of their daily events if you actually write in it. Check in and you'll be able to remember what you did last like magic. Gee, journey full of adventure. I envy you, kiddo. All I do is sit here and watch TV and make dinner. Plus, you're not alone. You have your Pokemon with you. Where's your father? You know, that, you know, supposed to give me a companionship? I don't know. I'm just joking, dear. Yep, really, I'll be right by myself. You go and enjoy your adventure. When you're exposed to new things and experience new sensations. Makes your mother happy, too. And I guess your dad, but who cares? Uh, come back sometimes. I would like to see kinds of Pokemon you've got, dear. Oh, hey. Sivio's mom. Uh, excuse me. Is my little Sivio here? Oh, uh, no. No, he's not. Oh, he must have left already. What to do? That boy should have shouted about going on adventure, then he bolted. So headstrong and reckless. I at least want him to take this. Not to worry. Brilliant will take deliver that to him. 
putting words in my mouth? I mean, I gladly will, but... Won't you, really? Oh, really? You do that for me? Please take this city out for me. A parcel. Bye-bye, really. Enjoy your little adventure. Let me think. No, my boy probably head straight for Jubilife City. Please take that to me, Sivio. What? <laughs> Verbs got bars. Wait, did I rest? I think she, I think she healed my Pokemon, yeah. No, I totally would. I just don't like people assuming I'll do something. If someone asks me to do something, it's like, yeah, sure, whatever. But if you just demand it, I'm like, oh, uh, I mean, maybe. I don't know. I think the big thing is that my mom does that a lot, too. It was oddly personal. Also, I like how we found a Starly, like, right here. Huh? Oh no! Tackle me! Mm, how do I do this? I can't kill him like this. Alright, uh, CEO, let's go. Yeah, this will be fine. Beaver, good, come back. You're in charge, CEO, Raptor Incorporated. Why is everybody coughing? Did I start something bad? I'm sorry, I didn't mean to... Oh, wait, I forgot to write these down, didn't I? I guess I'll check my map in a second. Ha <laughs> ha. It's okay, Sivia. I demand that it be okay. <laughs> I'm joking. But please be okay. I'm gonna kill this Starling. Will that be okay? Will that make everything better? I think it will. When do I learn Quick Attack? When do I actually kill this bird? 13 hours later, am I gonna lose CEO of Raptor Incorporated? That would be a wild ride, wouldn't it? I lost the CEO of Raptor Incorporated. Well, CEO is dead. Uh, Beaver finishes off. Ow. Well, the first death was, uh, anticlimactic. That rogue critical hit. But hey, we still got the beaver. But the rap business will never be the same. Alright, so let me do... <sighs> How depressing. Just started. I do not have a map, do I? I do not have a map. Trainer tips. Don't be shy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Need to know how to spell this lake thing. Variety lake. Or Verity lake front. So we got lake. What the heck? Verity. Variety. I mean, probably. <laughs> Oops. I will probably die without Starly. You are probably correct. But I got a beaver. Route 201. Uh, Bidoof. Togekiss is also pretty good. But alright, we're gonna... I got Nickelback on lockdown. We got this. But wow. Alright, I guess I should start this while we're going through here, because why not? Let me remove all these. Yes, I want to remove all the options. I gotta actually type these in, so I need to focus on that for a second. And start. 
All right, vote now if you want to box or release our fallen CEO of Rap Incorporated. Yeah, two minutes to decide, and as such, I will be arguing what I feel is best, and honestly, I think we should box it. I think boxing it would be best for the rap business, because they need to know what they need to do to make this town better. What they need to do to make the entire industry better is to look into the past and be like, hey, don't be like that bird that got critical hit in the face by another bird. Because chances are... Just be bad for business. We are going to store it temporarily just so I can heal things without feeling bad about it. Nope, I want to exit. Oh yeah, I can get that potion. I think there's like a free potion in here, right? Mail in the mailbox. Set or edit capsules for decorating Pokeballs? I don't have any seals. What does that mean? I can edit Pokeballs? I don't remember that being a thing. Well, that'll be fun. Well, let's see what the timer is at. Got a couple people that didn't vote, but it's fine. Apparently it was a thing. I don't remember that. I, do n I honestly do not have any memories of ever decorating Pokeballs. Go ahead and do this. You no longer vote on anything. Winning option is box it. So we had a boxing match. <laughs> Gonna name this appropriately. Ah, uh, no wait. Back. It is pretty morbid, but putting them into a crusher feels a little bit uh, awkward. Hmm. Corpse piles are in season. Oh, that's right. Really, I haven't told you how to catch a Pokemon. Never mind that you captured two and killed one. Demonstrate how to catch a Pokemon, okay? Hey, look, a Bidoof. I got a Bidoof. Church wig, go! What will Church wig do? Yeah, this is pretty dumb where it's like, you don't know how to capture Pokemon yet. Never mind that you have one in your party right now. Okay, its HP is down. Time for a Pokeball. Who knows? But she does have 20 Pokeballs. Gotta say, more than me. Maybe that's what they were looking for. It's like, do you have 21 Pokeballs? Do you have a Blackjack of Pokeballs? Oh, it's amazing. How to Bidoof. I'm so proud. Level 2 Bidoof. What are you gonna name it? You have to name it something, right? You're playing Nuzlocke too. <laughs> Isn't it neat? Actually, it's better to lower your target HP more than I did. Before to get the Pokemon's HP as low as possible. I always thought it'd be funny if they snuck in a small chance that they could fail, and the person will just look at you and be like, and that's how you don't do it. And then it just repeats itself. <laughs> or it just goes like, uh, you know what the base idea is. Anyways, I skipped past her dialogue, because I didn't feel like reading that stuff. Alright, anyways, we're here. I don't remember what route number this is. That's a trainer. Let's see if we can't capture a Thundercat. Ho! Oh, we captured that Thundercat, or at least we're gonna try! Hey, 
now. Alright, Beaver, do not kill the Shinx. I actually do like Shinx. But this is Emerald, because Brilly said Emerald instead of Platinum, because he's a big old dumb face. I'm sorry, okay? I wasn't thinking. Because we're reading something that said Emerald on it as I was glancing over and be like, well. But don't worry, I'll fix it in post. Uh, before he gets a lucky critical hit, I think I'm going to switch to Nickelback. Be gold. Dumb face mage brilliant. I think my defense is really high, jeez. Alright, Shinxy. Get in my Pokeball. Thank you. Alright, well obviously this one has to be Swing. Because it's Electro Swing. <laughs> the extension of a contraction of muscles generates electricity. It grows when in trouble. It gro growls. Glows. It does something when in trouble. It does all of the above. Alright, so what are we going to name this thing? It is a girl. So... Zimba. Like Simba, but evil. Everything the electricity touches is our kingdom. Why did I put a capital? Why, why did I do that? No, you know what? We're keeping it. I'm keeping that capital there, just because. Zimba. I had to get at least one X name in there. Alright, back to the Pokemon Center, because Beaver got beat up. Uh, let's see. Let's write down that thing, too. Route 202. Two to Shinx. Ba, 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 ba. Okay. Back to the Pokemon Center. So we got a Shinx named Zimba. Everything the electricity touches is her kingdom. Hmm. What was the girl's name in Lion King? Well, the bad sequel of Lion King. I know Nala was the love interest, but then there was like a sequel with like Scar's kid or something. It was really weird. I don't think it was ever really talked about. Kiara? That's not a bad name. It was just weird that he had a kid, I guess. I don't actually remember the plot, but I don't remember people enjoying it too much. It's the one you had as a kid. I think I had the VHS, but I never really watched it. It was more into Hercules. Oh, really? I've just heard people's, like, sass it, I guess, so I assumed it was bad. But hey, if you like it, then I will say that it probably is a pretty good movie. I think the issue is that it always gets connected with the, with, like, the original movie. And it's like, oh, this wasn't as good as, uh, the original. So obviously it's bad. Like, you know, uh, Crunk's New Groove wasn't exactly a terrible movie, it just wasn't really Emperor's New Groove. Yeah, exactly. But, you know, what can you expect? Uh, I'm so scared Beaver's gonna die. His attack stat is not great. Alright, Nickelback, let's go. You're in charge, Nickelback! What was, like, a hands-down, like, actually really good direct-to-VHS sequel for a Disney movie? Like, I'm trying to think of ones in general, but I kind of avoided most of them. I will say one thing I did like that was, like, a sequel uh, was the Lilo and Switch... Uh, Switch. The Lilo and Stitch series. I really like that idea of, like, all the other experiments being there and, like, wanting to find a place to belong. It was really neat. Really neat idea. 
You know, I probably shouldn't be sitting here just grinding, but it's kind of like the thing that I have to do in this game. Also, just to be clear, there will be points where I'm like, I need to grind, so we're not going to be playing all the time. Like, I'm not going to be playing this every single... I'm not going to be streaming this every single time I play it. Yeah, they had an excuse. Now, the one that... The series that weirded me out was the one where it's like Hercules goes to school and then Cusco goes to school. Like, that one wasn't bad because it had funny moments, but it's like, why did they go to school? Hercules is a demigod now. He has his strength. He's a hero. Why is he going to school? With all his powers. Hey, Cricket. And yeah, the Goofy movies were good, but I don't know if they would be considered sequels. I mean, I guess so, but... I have not learned my lesson. Uh, there was also one for Aladdin, I believe. Which had someone else playing Genie. I think the guy who played Genie is also the guy that plays him in Kingdom Hearts. I don't remember his name, though. And the Aladdin one was also weird. But the Goofy movies were good. But speaking of Kingdom Hearts, I really hope Max makes an appearance in Kingdom Hearts. It has been too long. I don't blame you for only watching two. It was not great. I watched probably like 10. I don't remember any of them. <laughs> I remember that genie was sometimes funny, but other than that, nothing really happened. There was a Little Mermaid one, wasn't there? I only saw the movies for that one. Like the one where she had a kid or whatever with the prince, and then the kid was like, I'm gonna go be a mermaid. And her mom was like, no, wait, why? Because I want to be part of their world, mom. Oh no, this is what that looked like, didn't it? I understand what my father was going through. Oh no! Except I have feet, this time. You know, that was a weird movie. Alright, I think we're gonna try to get past this guy now. Look at that stretched out shinks as an oversimplification. Uh, probably. But when do I not oversimplify things? I'm sure there were a lot more things to it. I just don't really remember what it was about other than that. I think what's her name comes back? Ursula or whatever? That's still weird. Or was there a new one? I don't remember. At least it didn't go off uh, Maleficent rules where it's like you remember her and then suddenly she's alive. It's like, oh, yeah, okay. It was Ursula's sister? Okay, that makes more sense, I guess. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Okay, we're gonna move Zimba to the front here. You're a Pokemon trainer, and so am I. Our eyes met, so battle we must. <sighs> they had to introduce at the start? Oh, okay. I mean, that fits. Like, what else would they do? She was not in the first movie. All right, Zimba. I'm just going to get you out of here. I'm so scared now, because everyone's going to die. Everyone I try to train just dies. Well, I can't be a teacher. They'll walk into the school and be like, why is your classroom dead? And it's just dead silence. It's like, oh, I'm putting on a movie. But uh, the sound's broken, so it's all quiet. Yeah, you thought I was going to go in a morbid way, didn't you? thought I was going to go down the morbid path with that. But no, I didn't. Also, I took 13 damage from that guy. I think. It's a lot of damage. 
Alright, well, I killed that kid. Can I take her? I don't think so. Oh, wait, I have potions. What am I doing? I had potions this entire time. I could have saved our CEO. But I was assured of his victory, and, well, that didn't work out. We need a new CEO. But who could possibly take Rap Incorporated? That's why with my little eye, a trainer. Battle, please. Bam, bam. I did. I let him die. I feel bad. I really do. This is what Nuzlocke is about, huh? I can see why I never did one. A conspiracy to change the music industry. You caught me. This is all an inside job. We are trying to replace the CEOs so we can change music at its core. I like that we're relying so much on Nickelback. But that's kind of normal, I guess. Is his hair actually fur, or is it fire? Like a little tough on the top. Yeah, he gave a little fire. Learn Leer. I don't remember if it was or not on... I know the tail is fire. I learned top. We killed Natalie. Oh, boo, I can't win. How long have we been going? Uh, one hour. Neat. Didn't really feel like an hour. Oh, okay. <laughs> but anyway, since so this is kind of what... This is probably what I'm going to have to deal with, is I'm going to have to come up with things to talk about, huh? Zimba, do you think you can take her? Probably. Wow, Shinx used Tackle. Oh, no. Leer at him. Is it working? Is his defense lowered? Are your defenses lowered? <laughs> Ran out of leers. Ouch. Well, Zimba, you did your best. Don't know what I was really expecting from you, but you gave it your best, and that's what I can really be excited about. Yeah, level six already. Nice. That was actually a lot of experience points for a little Shinx. Darn it! <laughs> Alright, so the big question is, what am I going to talk about? Because I don't really know. I got no ideas. Uh, I was considering going back to some old games. Playing different ones. How much damage did that do? I think it was only three. I'm scared, man. I'm scared. Uh, I was actually considering going back to Cuphead, being like, hey, I'm going to play this game. But I think the real thing I need to do is learn the speedrun for a hat time. I need to copy someone's movements. Because... Because, like, I have not put any effort into that at all. Figure out what Gob's picture was? I don't actually know what that is either. Oh, dang it. Let's have a Pokemon battle, but I'm gonna win. Oh yeah, that one. It's Naruto and Hinata, I think. I think that's right. Oop. Ooh, Burmy. I remember you. You get annoying later. Go Nickelback! Lay down some hot beats. Boom. Hang on, I need to minimize this. I had Steam open in the background. So I was just constantly seeing it flicker back to Nyan Cat in space. I'm like, all right. I got $80. I wish I could beat up someone for $80. No, I don't. <laughs> Maybe a Pokemon battle for $80. That'd be pretty nice. Although they would have be like, 
They would be like one of those IV trainers. The EV trainers, IV trainers. Be like, oh, okay. Just, I am not prepared for this. I have never bothered with any of that nonsense of training up a perfect Pokemon. I did try a little bit of uh, trying to hatch eggs for shinies. Because, you know, if you have foreign Pokemon, which I do, uh, you can use those and they will have a higher chance for shiny Pokemon for whatever reason. I don't know why, but... Get this Pokeball. I found a potion. You wasted 20 HP just to get here. Wasn't it worth it? Darn it! A Bidoof appeared. Let's go Zimba. Oh yeah, did it work out? For Shuppet. I actually do have a shiny su Shuppet. I think I evolved it though. Did a lot of damage. Oh, you want a really good one. That you never really used. Yep, that's how it usually ends up. <laughs> Either you make the perfect team for it, or... I don't know. I do have a couple shinies, though, which is pretty neat. Like, legitimate shinies. Not just the event shinies. Oh, hey. Hi, Brilly. Are you catching Pokemon? Um, I think you'd feel a lot safer if you were to catch some more. You know, like when you had to travel to faraway places. Oh, I know. Don't you think it's better to know more about Pokemon? Sure it is. I just don't happen just... I don't happen just the place. That's the sentence I said. I happen to know just the place, is what I meant to say, but I fumbled my words because I'm dumb. That man, what is he doing? Oh yeah, I forgot about this guy. What's his name? Looker? What? How did you know? How'd you unmask me as a member of the international police? Huh? What? I beg your pardon. I was just making conversation. <laughs> you claim you were only making conversation, do you? But I know better not to believe that. No, no, no. You recognized right away that I was someone extraordinary. That's why you spoke to me, is it not? Your power of observation is fearsome. Quite admirable, you are. Now that my cover's been blown, let me introduce myself. I'm a globetrotting elite of the International Police. My name, ah, I know, I shall inform you of my code name. My code name is Looker. That's what they call me. Incidentally, is the saying, don't be a thief, familiar to you? Yeah. Yes, that is correct. Taking what belongs to others is wrong. Fortunately, there are apparently those who do not heed these words. Or should I give them the, the other voice? The, uh, gumshoe voice? Oh, well. In Sinnoh, in fact, there are criminals stealing the Pokemon of others. I have, therefore, been on the lookout for characters arousing my suspicion. Incidentally, you are a trainer, yes? Perhaps you can make use of this? The Versus Recorder? How would that... How would that help me? It's a nifty device for recording a match. I obtain it because it's quite popular these days, but I, myself, I do not po do Pokemon battling very often. In better hands with you. Also, I have a request. If you are to see me again, I ask you not talk to me, for I am duty. On duty. But I also am duty. Actually, yes, yes, yes. You may speak to me. You must. Not because I am lonely. No, no, no. Just must inform me of bad guys. Must inform me of any happenings. Well, that kind of just happened. Working for the International Police must be hard. Really, here it is. This is trainer school. We kind of walked past it. Name says it all. I saw your friend Sivio go in earlier. He could still be in there studying. Okay, bye now. Should we go say hi to Sivio? First things first, gonna go heal. That's more important. Because, you know, might try to kill me. Take your Pokemon for a few seconds. I knew you were gonna say that. But... You are trying to kill me. Forgot all these all these guys in the beginning areas are all tutorial bots. You know much about Pokemon? Yes. Ah, I see. You are knowledgeable. Imagine you wouldn't need to visit their trainer school then. May discover something new. I might discover something new. 
like this special building. Uh, past here is a global terminal, your gateway to the world. Oh, I'm sorry, you don't have any gym badges? It's off limits if you don't have any gym badges. Sorry. How rude. So, does that mean Pokemon trainers are just unable to go there at all? That's pretty sad, honestly. Or non-Pokemon trainers, I guess, would be the better way to put that. Welcome! What do you need? I have one Pokeball, please. Welcome, what do you need? Airmail! Pokeball restores the cop Pokemon HP and eliminates any status problems. Neat. That will be useful when I poison something, inevitably. Okay. What do we need to do here? I guess we'll just keep going. I can go say hi to Sivial, but... There's a high chance I'll die. Alright guys, time to stop clowning around. Hi there! You should stick, to... stick around. We're doing a Poke Catch campaign soon. I need to brush up on the trainer school. No! I have the feeling they're going to make me go there. Route 204. Alright, what are we going to get here? Oh, there's a Pokeball over there. What are we going to get here? Oh, I did not expect to get something so soon. A Badoo. Meow. Let's tackle it. Simba missed. And then it grew up. No, like, you're... I don't know. They are a little bit linear. I'm going to critical attack it. I know for a fact that's what's going to happen. Let's just throw a Pokeball. Come on, Badoo. Yeah. Badoo, I captured you. Alright, what are we going to name Badoo? It's an adorable little flower type. To add to the Pokedex. What do we got here? Sensitive to the changing temperature, the bud is also said to bloom when it feels the sun's warm touch. Yes. The female... Ah, uh, no. That's not what I meant to do. No, I don't want another X team. I am done with the X teams. Feds. We got the cop Badoo here. Whoops, I didn't actually mean to press OK. Well, I guess that's actually official now. I did not actually intend to go through that, but whatever. We got the seed police. Go Zim. <laughs> Love Feds already. Wow. We gotta learn, we gotta teach Badoo, I mean Feds, the roar ability, so we can say they booked it because of the Feds. The Feds were here. Tackle attack. But I have the feeling, uh, I don't actually remember what Badoo turns into. I know it turns into a plant, obviously, I'm not that dumb. But, wow. That's rich coming from the one that said Emerald twice now. <laughs> Maybe I just wanted another gym. Oh, is that Roselia? I did not know that. <laughs> Bidoof. Bidoof and Bidoo. Whoop. What? Feds over here. We need to level up Roselia. I do like that Pokemon. She is very pretty. Pretty little flower that dances in the other gens.
At least Feds is a cute name. Wow. What does that even mean? Are you saying the other names are not cute? What? Wow. I am being insulted. I'm being sassed all over the place. Oh, weak looking trainer. Do you want to have a go? You want to have a go, mate? Ah, uh, it's Sarah, of course. Ooh, that's a level 6 Shinx. That... Oh, look at this little clap. It's adorable. But you're getting out of there because that's a level 7 Shinx. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't even know what Cartman sounds like. Oh, don't leer at me, Shinx. It's rude. Shouldn't leer at people. Forty-five points. Wow, level six already. Did not expect that from one fight, but it was a level seven Shinx. Oh, I should have said no. I was the weak trainer. I'll beat you with the magic card my dad gave me. Oh no, that is dead. Wow, this is getting oddly personal with Sarah and Tyler. I know two people of those names. Absorb! I feel bad for this magic card. Oh yeah, speaking of Cartman though. Uh, I did consider getting that new game that came out, but I'm not going to. I feel like that's one of those games that you kind of need to just play by yourself. Not because it's like a weird game or anything. Well, I mean, it is a weird game. Let's, let's be completely honest. It is a super weird game. But it's kind of one of those things that are like super dialogue heavy. And I talk a lot. Surprise. Spoilers. I mean, whatever. So I feel like it wouldn't really fit for what we were going for. So I was like, eh. I just won't get that game. Alright, so we're going to probably sit here and grind for a bit. Kill all these trainers, apparently. May I please trouble you for a battle? No. Wow, that's... It's weird. Exactly. Yeah, you're right. This is the completely silent stream. I might as well just go ahead and do this. Hang on. Yep, there we go. Now it's more accurate. I'll just go ahead and turn off the microphone, too. Hey, that's not true. You talk in those. It's just that the volume on your game's a little loud. Feds have grown to level 7. Learn water sport. I hate water sports. Hello, demon. How's it going? Hope you're having a good night. And yeah, a little bit. It does get a little bit loud sometimes. Alright. Let's see. The Feds are level 7, the Beaver's level 5, Zimba's level 8, and Nickelback is level 10. Can I go... Oh, well. I was going to say, can I go any further than that? The answer is apparently no. I cannot. My attack on a... F yep, my attack fell. This Shinx is very intimidating. Cut the Feds' attack. Makes it extra special we can we can hear you. That's right. Okay, we can probably absorb through this thing. But you know, most of the time we can hear you. Stressful midterm, oh no. Well I'm glad that here that is out of the way. I'm sure you did great. At least I hope you did great. 
The important thing is, did you feel confident in it, even if it was stressful? Because, and yeah, I mean, I think you could change those separately. To be like Ron. I don't know no Ron. Ron stoppable? Oh yeah, OP, if you're still here. Did you ever check out Kim Possible after our last chat? Oh, Delight, right. Kind of forgot that was his name. Hey, guy, how's it going? There are boulders blocking the way inside the cavern. I think a Pokemon hidden moon will smash those boulders, though. If it's hidden, how do you know about it? Okay, I'm going to save here really quick, just because I feel like there's a slight chance this might crash at some point. It's like, oh, okay. Like, listen to that, ugh. Oh, geez. Sorry to hear that you were behind in class. I know how that feels. But good on you for actually going out of your way to learn the material. All right. Just a uh, future notice. I'm going to go ahead and mute that because I know that is ear punishing. Yeah, future notice. Not going to be doing this kind of saving. I think I'm going to be dealing with save states because uh, that took a while and it was really laggy. Oh yeah, if you guys want to do song requests, go ahead. I can turn off the sound for this. Oh, now we're in a cave. Also, I forgot to write down those things, didn't I? Got a potion. Alright, we're in this cave. What is this cave's name? Okay, so that was Route 204, and we got Badoo. But, yeah, G-Man, good on you for actually going out of your way to do all that stuff. And glad to hear it went well. Or at least you think it went well. I'm sure it did if you feel confident, though. My hypothetical cat. Wow, I do not have a hypothetical cat, but I will keep my eye out for one. Ravage Path. What are we going to get in the Ravage Path? I'm going to say probably a rock. There's a chance. Or does this even have Pokemon in it? It might not have any. Nope, it does not. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Never mind. It's a bat. It's a zoo bat. It's the feds. Get him. I should have known it'd be a bat. It's all zoo bats. I'm okay with all zoo bats. Oh no. This is going to turn to a leash life battle. I better just uh, nip that in the butt. Oh no, he's stronger than me. Send in the beaver, no. I'm gonna throw Pokeballs. I'll catch a Zubat. Why not? I'm gonna go ahead and preemptively write that in, because there's no way I'm not gonna get the Zubat, right? Right? Isn't it supposed to be super effective? What type am I? Am I poison? I am poison, okay. I was pretty sure that uh, Roselia was poison, but I wasn't sure about Badoo. But I know that Leech Life is bug type. Got it. We caught a Zubat. What are we gonna name the Zubat, everybody? Should we go? It checks its surrounding surroundings and location using reflections of ultrasonic waves from its mouth. Like a bat. It doesn't have any eyes. They do say that justice is blind. But what are we going to name the bat? We can go obvious and just go oh, it's Batman. But no, that's dumb. Hmm. I see the best part about me doing this is that I can write my own head cannon for what these characters are, and it is actually canon. I could go with Bruce. Trash Akata. Trash Ahata. Why does it feel like it's a reference that's insulting someone? I don't want to name my 
Zubat trash? I actually kind of like Zubat. <laughs> no. No we yo. Yes? Ooh. I like the R. See, this is how I name things. I just put in random letters. Oh, it is a boy. So maybe R won't work. No, I don't want a J. J's are gross. I'm joking about the J's, by the way. They're not actually gross. I am sorry. Alright, this is taking too long. I should just put it in a name. Let's see. Name it OP. <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. Hmm. I don't think it really matters. It does matter. Pick a name I want? That's... Fine. Wait, no, what? I wanted to go this way. There we go. Wex Bather. Wex Bather. Arch nemesis of uh Well we'll make that up later. <laughs> of Mark Mint. Absorb! Drain the Bidoof's life force. Don't growl at me. This absorb special attack? I hope so. I also hope this is the generation where they have the split of special and normal attacks. I'm pretty sure that is. I'm pretty sure that's like Gen 3. So, we should be good. But it looks like absorb is affected by it, so that's sad. Or is it? No, it doesn't look like it is. Stop growling at me. It's actually this gen? <laughs> well then. I'm glad we picked this gen then. Nice, Loex. I'm glad the background noise could influence your play of the game, obviously. It's obviously the case, right? Time to retire, wow. All downhill from here. I think I will be taking a very small break here, just for a second. Just give me the power to do great things. Wow. Glad to hear it, I guess. I don't know if that's actually the case. I'm pretty sure your skill was 99% of that. But alright, I think I will be be... I think I will get up for just a second. So I'll be turning the music off and then playing that song I had as the intro. For the sake of, you know, not melting your guys' ears off. So I will be right back. I am actually out of water. That's the main reason I'm getting up. So... Let me do this. And then press this button. Uh, no, I'd probably get exploded for that one. All right, be right. Oh, wait. All right, here's the one with the lyrics.
I have returned. Hope you guys have enjoyed the song. And yeah, no problem, Phoenix. That would be pretty confusing. So, very small idea thing that I can talk about after the song is over. We're gonna probably grind for just a second. Get everyone to level 10, I think. Well, not everyone, but. At least three Pokemon to level 10 before I move on. Oh, yeah, small thing. Oh, never mind. Also, thanks for the follow, Dragon. Although, I guess you're not here anymore, huh? I guess I just didn't notice that he followed. Weird. <laughs> Playing favorites already. Well, I'm just gonna say, the Zubat is level 3, and I have no way to really level him up. Except taking him out. Which, I mean, I guess that's not bad. But it's, I don't want to sit here all day in front of you guys. It's weird. <laughs> like, I don't want to be insulting. Also, I should probably play a different song. Let's see here. Let's see here. Since you guys don't want to put in song requests, I'll just play thing. Although I'll probably get copyright, so maybe I shouldn't. I'll think about it. But Crobat, that is a good point. But I had you have to trade for Crobat? I don't remember. I don't think so. Pretty sure that was a level thing. Wow, a Zubat right out here. Good thing we got it. Good thing we got Badoo here, and not Zubat. It's a trade, darn it. Oh, it's friendship? Okay. Don't worry, it happens. Like, there are so many of those. That's kind of fair if you forget one. I forgot. Friendship during the day specifically. Oh no, we we'll have to play a day stream, which is so difficult. Guys. Friendship is my power. Friendship during the day. Wow, what is this? Kingdom Hearts. The TS upside down. That's not something I can do. I don't. I don't think. Maybe if I flip the screen upside down, it would register that. That'd be pretty funny. It could be. Only thing I remember is the Eevee ones is day and night. Uh, speaking of which, do we get an Eevee in this one? Actually, yeah. Go ahead and tell me if we do or not. I'm sure we do, but that's gonna be a big poll, I think. What? Yeah, I don't remember which one it is for the upside down one, but I didn't know it was a requirement. I think it was one of the newer ones. I think it might have been Sun and Moon. We're not going to do much to this guy. Okay. The squid? That's pretty funny. I think I did that, actually. Yes, what evolution will we get? Ow, critical hit. That was painful. Oh no, this Starly does quick attack. What could have been? Also, I should probably get Zimba out of here before he, she dies.
No, no, we were talking about uh, Crobat for friendship, right? Badoo is. Um... Badoo's just a level up, isn't she? And then after that, I think it's daylight. Ugh, this laggy music. Is friendship during the day? So I can't evolve Badoo till daytime. Jeez. Everyone wants to be my friend in this Pokemon party. Oh well. I guess that's fine. Kai the point. There's no better team. On and on, we'll win the fight. It's always been our dream. I don't remember half those lyrics, but... It's okay, Phoenix. Don't worry about it. Try getting Badoo and Zimba up to 10. I'll worry about the other ones later. Probably do those off screen. Although right now we're only grinding and we haven't even been to the first gym yet. But that's probably safe. Apollo, this is fine. Eventually I'll get that reference. What's the this is fine thing? Like, what would you want for a, a this is fine situation? Just the dog on fire? But Apollo instead? Yeah, I will. Oh yeah, I should go fix that while I'm thinking about it. Otherwise I'll forget. Let's see, stream stuff, Ankbot, uh, game requests. Oh, I need to go do it in commands. Whoops. There we go. Fix that, so now it's a, a lot more points. Mostly about the joke. Well, when we get around to it, I'll see what I can do. Because I don't... You know, Yeah, I do. I was going to say I don't know what Apollo looks like, but I do. Because he's in the... Um, that one comic thing. I forget the name of. I have it here, so I can look. Awkward Zombie, that was it. I've seen him in that, because I read all those. But if I can mix it off of that, I can probably just go ahead and make an emote like that. Wouldn't be too hard, I think. But what would you rather have? It's a secret to everybody, or Apollo is fine? That's the real question. Or this is Apollo. I think this is Apollo rolls better. Rolls off the tongue. Even though it's in text. But it rolls off the tongue in text. The text tongue. But stop talking. Starly fainted. <laughs> Apollo is fine is better than this is Apollo. I guess this is Apollo would be more like, no, this is Patrick. Then this is fine. kill this with this Badoo. I feel bad for not using the beaver, but I'll be honest, not a huge fan of Badoof. My Pokemon was killed by a Badoof once. Never again. What explain? Wow. Now I'm gonna feel like I'm missing the joke. And what do you mean soon? Maybe I'll never play Phoenix right again. That's a lie. I actually planned on doing Phoenix Wright tonight. That's what that flip in the Discord was for. Is I was like, I'm gonna play whichever one comes up on this flip. And turns out it was Pokemon. Which did kind of speed things up a bit, because I was gonna start like, you know, a little bit sooner than I ended up being, but, you know. 
That's kind of why the end, why the intro thing was uh, was kind of thrown together at the last second. It took a lot of annoying work too, because I can't get word wrapped to work, which is why one of those kind of popped up late. But anyways, it's also probably why I said Emerald because I didn't rehearse that or anything. I just kind of threw it together. But the important thing is. We will be going back to Phoenix Wright. I think one of the reasons I don't do it as often as I probably should uh, is a mixture of I'm doing all those TFS things, and the other part is just I kind of feel bad when OP's not here because <laughs> I know his favorite character is on screen. It's like oh, I don't want to do it without him here. He'll miss the thing. He'll miss me reacting to these coffee mugs hitting my head. But. I know I shouldn't do that, because then I'm OP will feel guilty. Yeah. Ah, it's so messed up. Darn these Bidoofs. This would be level 10. Because I don't have... I mean... My favorite one's Leafeon, so... My favorite evolution is Leafeon, and I always name it Rosa or whatever. Do I name it Rosa? I don't remember. I name it something Rosa. I don't even know if Leafeon's in this one. Right? Like, that one is one of the few times... Like, that is one of the few Pokemon where I'm like, I could buy a plushie with this and not feel guilty. It is? Oh, good. Well. She'll pick Umbreon. Which isn't a bad thing. I do like Glaceon, too. There we go. Well, I take that back. Uh, Mimikyu is also one where I'm like, I would probably buy a plushie of this. She picks Jolteon. Whoa. Out of nowhere. Out of left field. Or she'll pick Flareon. I figured it was, because it's the only one we talk about, I think. As you know, we got... Find it. Got that. <laughs> oh wait, no, I don't want to talk to you again. I mean, I will, but not this moment. I don't want to waste your time. Waste your time talking to this guy. Okay, so... What would like a subject to talk about? I feel like we're just sitting here grinding. That's that's probably a little boring. I'm scared to progress the story. I'm Simba. I'm going to eat bugs. Right now, you're bugging me. I guess she would sound different than that. She is a fancy electric cat, but I can't do voices. Any voice, any high-pitched voice I try to do would end up being something more along the lines of uh, Little Karibo's Taya. And that's awkward for everybody. Am I gonna die? Is Zimba gonna die? Nope, critical hit. Good job, Zimba. Oop. Level up. Come on, learn spark. Ah, learn charge. Wait, that's useless. Isn't that useless? Is that what I'm thinking about? Isn't that the one that, like, charges ability? Oop. Boosts the power of the electrical move and uses that. Yeah, it's useless, darn it. 33 more hours. Why does it learn... Spark? Why does it learn charge before spark? Doesn't make any sense. Now, look at that attack damage, though. It's 400 hours is a lot, guys. Almost 410. 
been live for two hours. Okay, I feel like I should progress the story now. At the very least, before we reach the end, I need to... Uh... Not enough, wow. It is definitely more than enough for a stream like this. Being says 122. Would like to rest your Pokemon? Yes, please. Is there, like, a guy that I can go to to be like, Hey, how much does this Pokemon like me? I'm pretty sure there is. Reborn has 417. That's too much, guys. But hey, give it another year. I don't plan on stopping streaming anytime soon, and I don't mean this specific stream, so don't even try it. There's a Pokétech app that can get interesting. Also, yeah, the bot is pretty new, so the hours are not actually too accurate. Because I'm sure you guys were in a couple of the streams before I got the bot. But, you know, Twitch itself probably keeps track of that somewhere. 33 experience points. Man, I wish I remembered anything but this character's hat. It's okay, Phoenix. You're here now, and that's what's really important, don't you think? Don't regret the past. Look forward to the future. Yeah, I mean, I had Nightbot, too. Of course, then it broke. Poor guy. Don't know what the deal is with that. Just, uh oh. Oh, wait. I know. I, that's alright. I was like, oh no, I used tackle instead of charge. Oh no, what am I gonna do? Oh, yeah, I wonder if I. Let's see here. I wonder how I do that. Hang on. Settings. I don't care about that. Man, I'll figure it out later. I'm not gonna waste stream time for this. One of us, what? What's going on? Uh, probably G-Man, but you're welcome here all the same. And I appreciate your viewership, that's a too bad. I look away for a second, you guys are chanting one of us though, what happened? Did I say something dumb again? I don't remember saying something dumb. But what I was going to do was give moderators the power to mess with Nightbot. See if you can't add commands and mess with that. But I think I'll just leave that alone for today. I'll mess with it after the shrimp. Because, you know, I know TFS has that. Alright, we got one more fight at us and then we'll be level 10. Because I say dumb stuff all the time, and people react to it, and then I'm like, wait, did I say something dumb? Or were they talking about you being all sad face? I don't know. I can't read minds. See? Sivia knows. Like, I can go on rants or start stories out of nowhere, and I don't remember half the things I say. Once upon a time, this crooked bide his time, and then he got punched in the face. Oh. Yeah, I'm not letting that happen. Glad I can read that sign sideways. Anyway, I saw that damage, I was like, oh, I'm not gonna deal with that. Sadly, yes, that is why you have the clothes. <laughs> So when I say I punched a bird with my uh, lightning cat, well, no, uh-oh. Never mind, the lightning cat ran away, because I'm not risking her dying right at the end. That would be so sad. Good job, Zimba. You are finally 
reaching level 10. We worked so hard for this for the past like 30 minutes. And you're dead. Exactly. Exactly that. Also, I need to go update that one list, don't I? Ooh, the lag of the music. Pixels and melting in the background. Should have definitely tested this before, but I didn't want spoilers. Stand up. Bam, 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 bam. Speaking of. I can get rid of 130? I don't even know what that is. I don't look at these. No, it's fine. It can stay. I said it, so it must be true. Right? That's how that that's how that phrase goes. Okay, so let's put Nickelback up front. I get the front row seat to Nickelback. Dying. Why do you have so many elevators in your cash? Well, why did I say that? That's a good that's a better question. Anyways, I think I need to go this way to progress the story. Or do I need to go talk to Sivy Al? Because I don't remember how to do that voice, and that's going to be pretty awkward when I have to talk to him. Go back to... Alright. Hey, police officer, how's it going, man? Route 218 up ahead is great for fishing hole that is most, almost unknown to people, even though it's on a map. It's fine. I got dumb ones like this. I've never seen drug, even seen drug, much less used drug. What does that even mean? What does that even mean? Hey, look. I found an X accuracy. X accuracy. I feel like that kind of sends the wrong message where it's like X accuracy. It's like, oh, this gets rid of your accuracy. And you're like, exit out. Nope. That's not how it works. Of course I did a random one. Yes, sir. An old rod's a good thing. You think so too, am I right? Yes, good answer. We can be friends. Here you go. That's my old rod. Cool. Put the old rod in the key farm. You can fish wherever there's body of water. Oh, and by the way, do you need any tips on using that fishing rod? Nope. Use a fishing boat? No, I said no. I said no. Stop talking to me. No. Okay. Yeah, she's my apprentice. That's the special connection. Okay, let's see. We got an old rod now, so now we can fish for stuff. Gee, I wonder what we're going to get with an old rod in a fishing hole. Here we go. Not even a nibble. Reeled it in too quickly. Okay. I think we need to go over here. I think that's the best way to do it. Not even a nibble. Gotta catch a magic carp. I know it's gonna be a magic carp, and we gotta catch it. Watch it be a Feebass. Wouldn't that be interesting? Uh, it's Catfish Mage Brilly. Thank you. Meow. Glurble, glurble. That's what fish make. That's the noise fish make, right? Not even a nibble. I can't fish. Why can't I fish? Give me the old rod right beside a body of water and I can't even use it. Where are the magic card? Thanks for stopping by, Loix. And hope you have a good night. Hope you sleep well. And I'll probably see you later. Probably. Not um. This episode brought to you by bait who even needs it darn it loix thank you for the bits i'm not complaining about the bits i swear look your bits got me those cupcakes were good bait those cupcakes were amazing bait and they got me this magic card so you know what we're gonna name this fish 101 we're gonna have something 101 
I was not complaining about the bits. I said I wouldn't, and I'm not. Name it Gold Pants? I wish it was shiny. That would have been a good... Good one. If it was a shiny Magikarp, that would have been amazing. Alright, so this was... What lake was this, by the way? It was lake something. Magikarp living for many years can leap a mountain using Splash. The move remains useless. So why is that useless? You leap up to a, the size of a mountain. Or the height of a mountain, rather. And then you just drop down. Whatever you land on is dead. Nicknamed the Cotton Magic Carp. Unless they're, like, made of clouds. Right, I will name it Golden Dance. I don't care. Golden. Look, it fits perfectly. Almost. emo for pants. I don't know why there would be, but just in case, you know? Does not quite fit. Sad days. Golden pant. Uh... Golden pant. Eh, you know what. Let's go with... In. Gold in. You know, golden pant just has doesn't have the same feel to it as pants. And what? What I say? Is it the? Is there an emo for pants thing? There should be. All right, but anyways, we got golden pants. What's this lake name? Thank you for telling me the opposite of what I wanted. I'll just route fool. Eighteen. Magic here. Fish. All right, what should we consider fishing? And yeah, it's pretty bad. I'm just gonna play the other song, I think. I'll just play the uh, in instrumental version of this. I don't know why I stuttered there. I just kind of couldn't think of the song. The adjective I was giving it. Oh yeah, I forgot what this one starts really slow for some reason. There we go. Meow, 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 meow. Pokemon brought to you by cats. Meow, meow. Meow, meow, meow. Pokemon Watch Company watches the world. Interesting. Uh, the lag. Like, I can't feel bad about emulating it because I own the game, but darn if I don't feel bad about the emulator being so bad. Let's go say hi to Sivio and also steal this Pokeball. Found an X Tech. Hey, Brilli, you come to study too? I went ahead and memorized everything that was on the blackboard. After all, it's green. It's also a strange job to avoid having the precious Pokemon hurt in battle, right? So really, what brings you here, huh? Got something for me? Oh yeah, I need to deliver the parcel, I forgot. Oh, what is this? Ah, score, it's a town map, huh? Why are there two in here? I like it a lot, I don't need two. Here, Brilli, you take one. <laughs> Why not? If it bothers you, I'll stop. But I don't know what other voice to give him. Yeah, according to this town map, because Ogbor, er, Orbor, uh, there's a city is where I should be going next. There's a gym there, it's purpose to raise the Pokemon I just got. I'm on the road to become the greatest entertainer of all time. See you around. So how and what? She was sassing me. So I named the rival after her. Oh, hello, old man. Hmm, yes. Oh, oh, you call yourself a Pokemon trainer, huh? And you have no Pokedex? That is a, that is a Pokemon or a Poke... Poke... Uh, Poke tech? I don't know. For short. Oh my, you are a rare case indeed. See, I invented and now manufacture a Pokédex. Not only that, I'm now conducting a Pokédex promotional campaign. All you have to do is find three clowns in Jubilife City. If you find them, I will grift you a Pokédex. Well, here's one clown. Hi, I'm Pokédex campaign clown. Let's roll out my question. Can Pokémon hold an item? Yeah. 
Ding ding, you're absolutely correct. Pokemon may hold a single item. Some items may affect as soon as they're held by Pokemon. Berries are eaten by Pokemon necessary during battle. Here you go, Pokemon coupon. Extra punishment with the voice. Wow. Now I gotta give that voice to everybody. Just go, hey, really? How's it going? Yeah, I'm Pokemon. Pokemon Tech Campaign Clamp. Let's roll out my question. Who's that Pokemon types? The moves also have types? Yeah. That's the wrong answer. What do you mean? I press yes. I press B on accident. I have a whole thing here. The whole thing here that says the commands. No, don't go. I'll stop. Jeez. Much more powerful. In coupon number two. I'm sorry, Sivia. I'll stop the voice. Find this clown, though. Oh, hey, Looker. How's it going? Ah, oh, it's you. Have no fear. There are no shady characters about except me. Do you have not obtained a Pokédex? Leave it to Pokédex is now free in exchange for some coupons. You stop you. Wow. Wow. I'm a Pokédex campaign clown. Let's put on... I guess that's fine. When in doubt, swing the electricity about. Pokemon grow by defeating others again. Yes. Is this really trivia if all the answers are yes? Darn tutorial clowns. Only thing you're teaching me is how to hate clowns more. Anyways, who was I talking to? Where's the old guy that I was supposed to talk to? Oh, he's right here. Okay, let me count your coupons. Uh, he's Pokédex here. I cannot count to three without it. Bravo, I say bravo. Turn the coupons and present you to Pokémon Watch. Or Pokédex. Oh, great. Now I have a watch. It's 39. Touch the Pokédex screen to find the apps that are right for you. Now we have the Poke Watch. Uh, well, I guess now I don't even need to put it on screen. I can just have them here, huh? Oh, is this the... This is the step counter. Nice. Oh, I like that. Here's a little animation when I press the button. And I have a built-in calculator. One times three equals three. Oh my gosh. It's a good thing that guy had the watch, otherwise he would have never been able to solve that problem. Anyways. Oh, welcome back, Sivia. Uh, we should go heal our golden pants. Something about what I said didn't sound right, but it works. Take your Pokemon for a few seconds. We now have a full party, guys. It took two hours, but we have a full party. Yeah, obviously you actually left. Why else would you say that? Okay. We talk to Looker. Oh, he's gone. Did he replace himself with a sign? Is he a ninja? Along with the detective? A ninja detective? Oh, 203. Not 302. Hey, really? Tell me you got a little tougher. Me? You need to ask? Of course I got tougher. Come on, I'll demonstrate for you. Uh oh. I don't know if I'm prepared for this fight. Hopefully he's going to be like level 9 or 8. I feel like Chimchar was made for him, though. Like the character himself. Because he just does this arm thing. It's weird, man. Ember. Come on, burn the bird. My CEO dies, so does yours. That's how business works. That's business. With a capital B. Stands for Brilly. Sent out Piplup. Time to switch out, because I'm not fighting you. Gotta send in the feds. Uh, yeah, we got a penguin with no suit here. We need a... 
someone to deal with this. Yeah, I put in a bunch of letters and then was like explaining how I usually name stuff. It's just I put in a bunch of letters and go with whatever that f feels like, basically. And, uh, it's like, oh, well, I put in these letters and now this is the only name that comes to mind is Nickelback. Same thing with CEO. It's like, I just put in random letters. CEO was the first few letters. I was like, all right. I know exactly what we're going to be going for. And it was clearly Nickelback. No one can argue it was not Nickelback with some vowels missing. It was like in CK something. I don't know. I don't remember what it was. I just remember it looked like Nickelback. We just absorbed this penguin to death. Nickelback grew to level 11. He may be named Nickelback, but he's never giving those nickels back. What just happened? I lost? What? Well, what do you mean I lost? That's it, really. That's the last time I'll ever lose. I'm going to be the world's toughest trainer, you know it. First thing I'm going to do is take on Orbor City Gym. I'm tough enough for that, totally. Okay. So here we go, guys. What are we gonna find? If it bothers you, I honestly will stop. I don't mind. I just don't know what other voice to give him. Starly. Oh no, Starly. Be prepared for a bunch of nonsense, Phoenix. I should also tell you that uh, it takes a bit to actually name him. You have to go back to Professor Rowan. To get the nickname thing for him. For whatever reason. It's kind of weird. <gasps> That's not good. That's not good at all. I would love to have an Abra. But there's a 39 billion percent chance this is not going to work. Alright, here we go. The one hit wonder. Fly, fly, butterfly. There it goes. Teleports away. Abra. Not caught. Well, there goes Abra. It's okay. I didn't actually expect to do that. But per the Nuzlocke rules, that means we cannot capture anything here. So Route 203, just gone. Except for water, if there is any water here. Oh yeah, that's what I was going to talk about earlier. Should we consider fishing land or sea? I would kind of say land. So that way I can't fish in places and just save everything for surfing later. But... I'm not, like, you know, experienced with uh, Nuzlocke, so I don't actually know what the usual ruling is on that. Gonna get leech lifed. Now, I probably should be listening to... Oh, I just noticed what the video is for this, but probably should be listening to, like, Pokemon thing. What is that supposed to be? Yeah, I can be Pokemon. Eat up that kid. Huh. Just knows what that song actually is. The one from Tom and Jerry. Favorite Pokemon should be placed at the top left of your party. That's not how that works. That's not what favorite means, I'm afraid. Get level 12 or something. Well, yeah, I'm not. I've only watched them. And even then, I've only watched TFS do theirs. I was never really interested in the concept. But, people like watching them. They love the stories that could be... brought to life. Like, I can go ahead and tell you a story for all of these guys that I have in my head. Let's see. 
Internet, please. Oh, no. Is it buffering? Let me check the ping. That is pretty bad. We've missed 0.5 frames, which is not bad, given that we've been on live for 2.30. But uh, kilobytes per second is 7... Er, no, that's 25,000. So, I don't know if that's good or bad. I think it's good, right? I don't know. Why am I getting mentioned? Oh, that. Uh, it could be Twitch. But let me know if it persists. We did just lose a couple more frames, actually. So it might be on my end. Ow. Oop. Back to this guy. Yeah, I know. But if everyone's having issues, then it's probably on my end. Also, we're hitting the 230 mark. It's pretty nuts, guys. Didn't actually expect this to last this long. I kind of... A small part of me was like, Oh, you're going to die in first round, aren't you? Like, yeah, probably. Here we are. Level 12. Gold pants in hand and... The feds on call. Think of a clever joke, but... Clever jokes are not exactly my forte. I can make puns. But even then, that's usually in text, because I usually go like, mm, okay. Trainer tips. Pretty sure we can only find magic cards with the old rod, so I'm not going to bother fishing there. Oh, hello. Mot shop, not what I was expecting. Sick out the feds. We got a fighter in the streets. Go ahead and stun spore this guy, because there's a high chance he'll kick my butt. I am a grass type, though, so that's usually pretty okay against them. Low kick. Ah, joke's on you. Low kick only affects your weight attack, I think. Or does extra damage based on weight or something? I don't remember. The point is, Badoo has no weight. Light as a feather. Like a pedal in the wind. I don't know. Those one flowers that always fly off. Don't remember. I'm gonna drain this guy's life energy. Clear all you want. This tree will stand tall. It's paralyzed. It can't move. Not good for a fighter, that's for sure. Okay, can we do this? Wow, double paralyze in a row. Pretty nice. The feds have gained 127 EXP and leveled up. Wow, nice. I thought that would stop like halfway through. Guess that means I'm not ready for the gym challenge yet. Yeah, you never go in there with one Pokemon. Don't believe you don't have a single gym badge. You're a total nobody. Wow, will this total nobody just beat you another total? I'm sad. There's two total. Oh, trainer, we're looking for some Pokemon. I do like that these trainers actually move around. Like, this girl could have just been a random NPC in the old one. Caitlyn. Weird how I know most names here. I guess they're just very common names. The translator did a good job. Absorb this Bidoof. Or should we switch? We do have two Pokemon, three Pokemon now that we're not even using.
dare taunt me? Alright, now we can actually send in this guy. Just for the free EXP. Or should I send in Beaver? I think Beaver needs stuff. I can grind up Wex Bather later. All of this nonsense in my... In my music. Use teleport, but it failed. You can't teleport away from a battle. I've tried. I hit the ceiling. How dare you taunt me with that ever? I bet it's the same one I failed to catch, too. Because that's how that works. Sin in Badoo. How dare you. It's almost like we are going on the same routes or something. Go. Wow. Good job, Beaver. I think next time we get to the town, we'll probably give it a stop point right there. But, since we are getting a little bit close, I do want to discuss, like, what should I do with the little red block down there? Should I put something else there? Should I... Uh... Make that the official graveyard and put all their sprite work of all the fallen there? That way, even if they're not boxed, they can be remembered in some way. I'll leave that up to you guys, because the plan was to figure out how to modify this so I could actually have my real team there at all times, but I couldn't figure that out, so. But that is why the Pokeball red space is there. Pokemon is it Tackle. Will my Beaver use Tackle? What are you going to do about that? I'm going to live, that's what you got. Don't get a critical and kill Beaver, please. Okay, good, thank you. Will die for your... I don't know the word I should be using here. Finish so soon? Uh, you died, lady. Alright, well, Beaver is out. I can just find an image, eh, images of them and just have them up between streams. But the thing is, I don't know what I'm going to get. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to lose. And I don't want to go and download... 600 Pokemon for the chance of getting them we can easily I can easily do it between stuff but I also don't want to interrupt like the stream for that too like if this was a video I was just recording absolutely it's not because that sounds difficult There are 600 in Sinnoh. I can't tell if that's sarcasm. You did use the smug face. But you also might just being sm be being smug because you think I guessed it, but I didn't. Kind of. I just knew that we were at 800, so 600 sounded pretty right for Gen 4. Oh no, I lost. Haha. <laughs> I don't know how much is in here. I'd say probably like 300. I guess I can check the Pokedex, huh? Does it only go to things I know? Yes, it does. Wow. It's 400 something? Okay. I guess Gen 5 and 7 or whatever. Dare taunt me. Same route, so. I'm going to stun you. You're going to be paralyzed the rest of your life. And you're just going to have to deal with that. <gasps> Synchronization? How dare you. Wow, it actually got paralyzed. I'm going to kill it. Yeah, I'm sure we're not going to see, like, Blastoise or anything. Alright, teleport. That would be nuts. Well, the Blastoise's pose in this generation is actually really good. I did look that up when I was looking up sprites. Because I was just going to at least add the starter, but then I was like, that's kind of unfair to the rest of the Pokemon I'm getting. So I didn't. There you go. My hubris is your punishment. 
210 in the Sinnoh decks. I guess that's not too bad. I just need to figure out which ones, but that's a lot of downloading. I'll figure it out. It's not a big deal either way. I do have a list of all the sprites thanks to uh, Reborn. Giving me links for that. That's not the hard part of, like, finding them or whatever. I wouldn't catch, but I could still have them. Because, you know, I might get things that evolve into them. You did. Reborn did help. Maybe. Maybe they'll die. I found a repel. Neat. Why is Badoo blacked? Oh, because it's paralyzed. Duh. Go ahead and switch out. You're level 12, feds. I need to start saying their names instead of just saying... Saying whatever. Maybe feds is not even actually one Pokemon. It's just a collection of Pokemon. A collection of a feds on a plant or borg gate or borg gate wow i could find the uh, other one i assume or should i include that in the species clause would that be species clause i guess it would be actually this guy probably has a zoo bat wouldn't he I say we could find the evolved form, but I think that might just be like locking that out. That's a sparkling new Pogo watch. Your awardness as awkwardness as a trainer, I don't know. You're still a pretty new trainer, aren't you? That's all good. You're a fellow friend of Pokemon. Let me take a gift of this hidden machine to you. HMO6. I think what I said was if I had caught it, then we will say that that is part of the species clause. So if it has a little Pokeball on it. Well, that badge can't make use of the hidden machine Rock Smash outside of battle. Who should I teach Rock Smash? Badoof. Give him a fighting move to crush those rocks. I would say no, but at the same time... Wait, did he just learn it? Oh, wow, he had his open slot. Yeah, I would personally say no, but I'm not doing this just for me. I'm doing this for you guys as well. So if you guys were like, yeah, I think it counts as having it for the evolved one, then I'd be like, yeah, okay. I doubt we'll find one, but I thought that about Pidgeotto when I was a little kid. Like, oh, I'm never going to find a Pidgeotto. I think I better evolve my Pidgey. But then, like, later on, you find, like, a billion of them everywhere. And you fight that Pidgeot. It's like, whoa. That thing has sick hair. Totally gnarly hair, Birdman. There goes Starly. Actually, quite common. Oh, no. If anything, I think it makes it harder for me, which is a little bit okay. Like, I don't want this to be super hard, but... Go ahead and heal just in case I die. This thing probably knows Spark, even though I'm higher level. Soft and smooth, like caramel. I'm gonna tackle this Shinx to death. Quite an intense battle we've got here. One cat tackles another cat, and then the cat uh, stumbles back and tackles again. Get a critical hit because it's a punk. Get another critical, good.
Well, I kind of like what TFS did with that idea, where they were like, okay, we know that this upgrade version is here, so we're going to go evolve our thing so we can avoid it. I kind of like that idea. But I guess if I haven't seen it, I wouldn't know it's there. But I guess that is also fair. That is also a fair way of doing it. Like, I can't do anything about it if they're dead. <laughs> so it's my fault for letting them die. Hello, Bidoof. How's it going? Do you remember, Zimba? Remember who you are? Don't use defense, Curl. Who even taught you that move? Think curling up in a ball is going to save you from Zimba? He goes straight for the throat. Picnic near Diana. Teaching her Bidoof how to curl up into a ball. Probably uses them as a pillow. Oakberg City. Hey, guy, how's it going? Howdy, trainer. No, no, don't move. You don't have a single gym badge? I heard something about that. that take you to the Pokemon gym. Here we go. As if it was a requirement for society. How did I survive this long? How did I get 10? Huh? There's someone there. I'm going to walk away. <laughs> Sivio looks over like, oh, okay. I would say yes, since he's dead. When I run around with my running shoes on, I'm the center of attention. That's what it feels like. There's always someone looking at me. Go in here real quick. Yeah, I got a pal pants Pokemon Wi-Fi to clip downstairs. Let's heal up. Okay, so I'm going to say one little thing here. I really like these guys. They're always in these games. And they're always glaring at each other. And then you can do this. You can battle friend with wireless communication. You can capture battle via using versus recorder. Who you have a versus recorder? You can make them look at each other on the screens and just glare. Okay, so... I kind of want to put up Wex Bather and Golden Pants. Just so I don't accidentally use them. You know? Avoid the raptor in there. Don't move. They can't see you. That's how that works, right? Oh. You know, I'm not going to have a friends or loser box. Everyone's my friend. Alright, now the big question is, what time is it? We got 15 minutes to go kill that gym. But first, we got to talk to Sivio. Eh? Oh, it's you, Breathing. You finally got here? You're so slow like always. Anyways, Jim Lee is tough. Like, seriously, serious. Jim Lee is this tough? I wonder how he compares to my dad. Huh? Yeah, I just drifted here. Anyways, Jim Lee has gone after the coal mine. If you want to take on Jim Lee, you better go off to the mine. Well, okay. Guess we gotta go to the mine. Uh, how many Pokeballs do we have? Six. Hi, right, what do you need? I could buy nine potions if I really wanted to. If I so desired. These guys usually have stuff. Staff by a lady and a young fellow. Offer didn't kind of merchandise, did you know? You should probably start with did you know. Just saying. Did you know that things actually sound like an actual trivia if you start with did you know? So what do I know? Alright, let's go to this coal mine.
Route 207. Oh, we didn't get anything in Ogborg Gate, did we? I should go back there and fight stuff. Did I know that you were the best? Yes. Obviously. Uh, it's beautiful. I'm okay with this. I'm gonna kill it, but I'm okay with that too. I'm not actually okay with that. Don't kill it. But look at those eyes. Those precious eyes. Okay, I was scared I actually did kill it for a second. <laughs> they growled at me. That should be fine then. If I tackle it. Don't get a critical zip. I know that's your motive. Okay. Thank you, Zimba. You have gotten me a new horse. My first impulse name is Epona because I'm a total nerd. But... I don't think that's a good name for a horse. Not when she's on fire. Ponyta was caught. We already have a fire type. That was the bad part. Alright, so what's a fire horse name? What's the name for a good fire horse? What? It's gonna say, like, what band always releases the hottest beats? But I don't know. I mean, it was something super easy. Yeah, I can just put it in random letters. I don't know. Just straight up Fire Horse third? Fire Horse three? I'm not against that. We can just have her name be Fire Horse. But. Blazing Saddle. Go in between. Blazing. Can't get it to work like that. Yeah, we could just go complete. Butcher all the vowels. What are vowels? Blazing sad. We have an emote for fire. I should have an emote for fire. Why is there an umbrella emote? And a snowman emote? And I don't even know what that is. What even that? What is even that supposed to be? Sun. <laughs> there you go. Ponyta's nickname is Blazing Saddle the Sun. Hey, berries. I found a Pokeball. That would have been useful like five seconds ago. All right, time to go kill more Ponytas. Hey, Zubat. I could have gotten a Zubat here. Probably because it's nighttime. But it looks like that we're not going to be able to get to that gym leader because my plan was to do that and then cut it off at three hours. Don't leech my life. I barely have any of that left. Also, thank you for the name suggestions, guys. I do appreciate that. We're actually going to go back, I think. Or should I go forward and go to the coal mine? Could have gotten a mod shop. I, I already have a fighting type, too. Kind of sad my starter fills in two rolls, but... how starters are. Okay. I kind of prefer Ponyta, anyways. Machop's cool and all, but there's better fighting types. 
Getting pumped, though. Get you pumped. Got 12. Might need a backup later. You're not wrong. Oh, it's the guy you like, oh, this slope's too slippery. You need a bike to get up. You don't have a bicycle? This is a cycle shop in Eterna City. Now, let's try to get to the coal mine, I think, actually. There's stairs over here. There are not stairs over there. Wow. I guess it would make sense, or it wouldn't make sense to put that slope there if there were stairs there. So I'm a dumb. We'll punch through this Machop real quick. Gonna need all the EXPs I can get. Focus your energy. Don't get pumped in front of Zimba. She's very impressionable. Wow, that critical hit. Ha! That critical hit! Get crit, get hit. Okay, let's go out of here. Probably heal up, maybe store away the Ponyta. Blazing Saddle Sun. Will going in the box. Like to rest your Pokemon? Yes. After we heal her up, of course. Can't send her to the box with wounds on her. Oddly specific Zimba wounds. What if she has Flame Body? You know what fire type I am hoping to hit is actually a Vulpix, but I don't even know if that one is in here. I get a shiny nine tails. That would be pretty neat. Right. It's not in this darn. I put up the screen and everything. Well, that's how the cookie crumbles, I guess. I was not expecting this. I was not expecting this at all. Sai yai yai. Don't die yai yai, sai yai yai. Don't do it. Okay. Just tail whip. Uh, unironically unconnected to you, uh, Vulpix and Ninetales are my favorite fire type. Always have been. Like, the second I saw the shiny form, I was like, that's, that's it. And I always like foxes, too. More than dogs. Don't tell Mr. Arkin I said that, though. Fire power is weakened. But, you know. I'm pretty sure he knows I prefer Ninetales. I'm okay with dogs. But fire dogs? It's like... It's like I gotta pick up... Their mess. And it's all on fire. What we gotta name is Psyduck. Overwhelmed by in enigmatic abilities, it suffers a constant headache. It sometimes uses mysterious powers. Get a nicknamed Cat Psyduck? Guy Psychic, and it's a duck. So obviously, I need to combine the two. Most known characters mob and knight fight or should I go knob that sounds silly I do this real quick uh, we know it's in others that's right Little emotes. It's adorable, but no.
There we go. What? Nah, that's silly. Well, it's demon might. And there we go, we have Psyduck, the Mighty. The mob and Knight fused together. They make a psychic duck. I was gonna put stars and like a face, but that's too silly for a name, I think. And we're actually gonna keep him on the party because he's a psychic water type, and I could probably use that. But I will say that might be the end of the stream for tonight. That's fine, sir. We were actually just about to stop, but thank you for joining me. And have a good night, sir. And to the rest of you, also have a good night. I hope you enjoyed the start of the Nuzlocke. Sorry for my mini blunders. Sorry for the silly voice. And look forward to the continued adventures of... Uh, press the right button. Of Zimba, Nickelback, Beaver, The Feds, and Might. It's all right. Turned out all Might. But yeah. I think that is going to be the end of the stream, guys, for tonight. Best Emerald Nuzlocke so far. It's practically platinumed. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I'm going to go ahead and turn this up, I guess. And I hope to see you again probably tomorrow. I'm not sure we'll continue this tomorrow, but it will have a stream tomorrow as long as I don't explode. But that's always at risk. And to anyone who is in the YouTube video, thanks for watching up to this point. Look forward to more. And good night, G-Man. Thanks again for stopping by. Hope you enjoyed what you saw. I'll see you guys later. Plus Ultra Ball. Darn it, OP. That's too good. I should have put him in an Ultra Ball. To go even further beyond an Ultra Ball. But I'll see you guys later. Thanks for joining me.